Can I hear louder? Hallelujah. Let's turn to First Samuel chapter two or chapter one. First Samuel chapter one. I read verse twenty-seven. For this child I prayed, and the Lord has given me my petition, which I asked of him. Therefore, also, I have lent him to the Lord. As long as he liveth, he shall be lent to the Lord. And he worshipped the Lord there. Praise God. At this moment, we want to dedicate uh, one of the newest baby in the church. And dedication serves two purposes. Number one, to offer the child symbolically back to God. And number two, to officially welcome the child into the fellowship of God's people. And like Hannah said, the Lord has given me my petition. And I believe they prayed. And I also have lent him to the Lord. As long as he liveth, he shall be lent to the Lord. Praise the Lord. Parents, are you ready? Where are they? Church, how do we welcome them to the front? Where are they? Where is the child? How do we welcome them? Help with them. Thank you so much, Lord Jesus. Thank you so much, Lord Jesus. Thank you so much, Lord Jesus. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you. Thank you so much. of a baby or you how many names do you have for the baby three names. only three <laughs> I thought you will have a uh, as we now do many many names that you perhaps cannot even recollect all praise the Lord <laughs> for this child I prayed there is uncle For this child I prayed, and the Lord has given me my petition, which I asked of him. Parents, I know you prayed for this child, and this child is blessed. Amen. And I will remain blessed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Therefore also, I have lent him to the Lord. And you are offering this child back to the Lord. And we're welcoming this child into the sanctuary of God's people. Amen. Church, what do you do? Is that the best you can do? You know what this means? Amen. This child will not be found on the streets, Amen. loitering around. Amen. Rather, he will be on the streets like John the Baptist declaring the counsel of the Lord. Amen. This child will not be found in low places, but Amen. will be found in high places. Amen. This child will not be found in the prison, Amen. but will be found in the palace. Amen. Declaring the counsel of the Lord. Amen. And we say, child, you are going to be extraordinary. Amen. Whether it's not optional, receive it. So what are the names? Amen. Let's, parents, tell us the names. Saya Ndi Tanifo. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Church, can we repeat that? Saya Ndi Tanifo. Now we're going to take those names to the Lord in prayer and say, these names we dedicate to the Lord. Let's stretch our hands towards the baby. Saya Ndi Tanifo. We dedicate this name 
to the living God. We dedicate these names to the King of glory. We dedicate these names to the King of the universe. Sire, in the tiny form, you'll be a vessel unto honor. You will serve the living God. You will not serve idols. You will not go astray. Parents have prayed. God has answered. And they are offering you back to the Lord. They are going to do their part. They are going to train you in the way of the Lord. And you'll be receptive to godly counsels and instructions. And we use this as a point, this child as a point of contact to every other child across the region. We dedicate you all to the living God. You will all serve God. You will serve your generation. You will not be cut short. You'll be above only and not beneath. In the mighty name of Jesus, we call on Pastor Ladele to come forward and, and pray. Father, once again, we thank you for this blessed baby. The Bible says, and the child grew in favor with God and men. Pray that this child, as the parents have dedicated, child to you, Lord, we pray that from the beginning of his life to the end, Christ will be all in all in Jesus' name. Pray that everywhere the soul of his feet shall tread, there you have given to him as his possession. And no man shall be able to stand before him all the days of his life. He will be a shining light. He will live to glorify Christ. And all that is needed to take care of him, you will provide according to your riches in glory. The parents will not lack. Amen. You will open doors for them. Amen. And your favor will be upon the child. Amen. Thank you, Father, because you've answered. We use this as a point of contact to all children. They will grow in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus. Amen. And they will be established in the house of the Lord. And those that have gone away as children under their appearance, you'll bring them back. Amen. And the joy of their parents will be full as they nurture them and grow in the presence of the Lord. And those who are waiting upon you for the fruit of the womb, as you remember Hannah, remember them to this day. Amen. This day of the resurrection morning, let the power of resurrection enter into their womb. And let their womb come alive. Amen. And let their children spring forth. Amen. That they will come forth to dedicate them here in the presence of the Lord. Amen. Do it and take the glory. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You know, we have a father in the house that children are there to. And uh, we're going to, because we're not just looking at this child, but we're also looking at all the children in the Deeper Life Bible Church worldwide. And we know God is raising an army. And I uh, want to give our Father the privilege of uh, prophetically making some declaration, not just concerning this child only, but to every child that's out there and to the church at large. Praise the Lord. Let us pray. Father, we are grateful because you are the God of all creation. You are the God of power. You are the God of might. Yes. We thank you for the life of this child and the purpose for which you have created him. We pray that that purpose be fulfilled. Amen. And nothing on earth, nothing in the heavenlies will truncate that plan and the purpose of God in Jesus' name. Amen. We declare and decree that this child will be a burning and shining light. Amen. He will live to fulfill destiny. Amen. His destiny will not be destroyed. Amen. The light of his life will not go down. Amen. But rather, he will shine and shine for God's glory. Amen. We pray that you grant unto him the gate of his enemies. Amen. You cause him to know the Lord, Amen. to love the Lord, Amen. to live for God, Amen. and to do his will. Amen. We use him as a point of contact to every child in our homes, in our families, in our churches, that the mighty hand of Jehovah will come upon them. Amen. Every contrary hands in their lives we cut off now in Jesus' name. Amen. We declare and decree 
that thou, O Most High, will raise them up as representatives of heaven. Amen. Representatives of heaven. Amen. Ambassadors of the Almighty God Amen. in their generation. Amen. They will continue to show for the light of the gospel. Amen. They will not fail. Amen. They will not fall. Amen. All our children will not falter. Amen. The hands of God will be mighty upon their lives. And all they lay their hands upon to do will prosper. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you so much. Thank you, we thank you, we thank you, we thank you, we thank you.